Americans love their big cars. A study was done by HIS Automotive, and they say that 63% of the cars sold in the U.S. in 2013 were bigger than your average vehicle. To compare that figure worldwide, only 23% of cars sold outside of the U.S. are large vehicles. Fuel is also more affordable in America, which makes driving a big vehicle an option that many don't have. Today, we'll take in a broad variety of vehicles, so pop your seatbelts on and let's go for a drive. Mercedes Maybach Vision 6 Cabriolet. This beauty was unveiled in late 2017 in California. It doesn't have any size specifications just yet because at this stage, it's still a concept car. Mercedes Maybach still seems convinced that it's not going into production anytime soon. If it was though, it would be high on our list of the world's biggest cars. The one that was unveiled was just under 20 feet long or around 6 meters. It's the same as the extended wheelbase version of the Rolls-Royce Phantom and only seats two people. It was made as a vision of the future vehicles it could be produced in the future of 2035 and beyond, says Mercedes Maybach. Ukrainian Antonov AN-225 Mira This massive vehicle holds a few world records and it was built to transport the Soviet Union space shuttle. Produced in 1988, this craft could lift 559,577 pounds or 253,819 kilograms. When the space program was cancelled in 1991, the craft was left in the Ukraine. Because this massive craft has so much incredible lifting abilities, it's now used to carry heavy cargo around the world. The last update was that it carried the longest piece of cargo in 2010, two 138 feet or 42.1 meter long wind tent turbines which went from Tianjin China to Sturgia, Denmark. The heaviest load it carried was in 2009 when it transported a generator for a gas power plant in Armenia. The load weighed 189 tons or 417,000 pounds. Dodge Power Wagon These bees were first introduced in 1945 and were primarily used for the military and meant to compete with the military-based Ford Marmon Harrington and GMC trucks. Near the end of 1946, the first civilian Dodge Power Wagon was produced. The original Power Wagon had a gross vehicle weight rating of 8,700 pounds or 3,946 kilograms. It had a maximum payload of 3,000 pounds or 1,360 kilograms. This vehicle was discontinued in 1968 but was still exported up until 1978. The Dodge Ram came after this, with Dodge Power Wagons being the collector's item today. NASA Crawler Transporter NASA developed these Jimungus Crawler Transporters in 1965 to carry the rockets to their launching pads. At that stage, they were the largest self-powered land vehicles on the planet. They were 39,920 meters long by 34,747 meters wide. That translates to 131,000 feet long by 114,000 feet wide. Even had their own names, Hans and Franz. They're still being used to transport shuttles, rockets, and even the space launch system. The American Nimitz-class aircraft carrier These nuclear-powered aircraft carriers were built over 38 years ago and were commissioned in 1975. The first part built was the USS Nimitz and the most recent addition was the USS George H.W. Bush, commissioned in 2009. There are 10 total, and each one measures 332 meters long, or 1,091 feet long. They can reach speeds of 30 knots, and have a full load displacement of over 100,000 long tons. The Marauder Considered to be one of the best military vehicles available to civilians, the Marauder has been in production since 2008. Roughly 300 vehicles have been produced. These hefty vehicles are produced by Paramount Group in South Africa and mainly exported to the Middle East. The vehicle has made a guest appearance on Top Gear, where it went through a drive through drove off-road, and withstood plastic explosives set underneath the vehicle. Each model can be customized, and they sell for around $523,000. Ten people can be inside the vehicle at once, and Azerbaijan has ordered the most at 85. Russian Mil V-12 Helicopter This is the world's largest helicopter and it first went into design in 1959. The initial brief was to build a helicopter that could lift 20 to 25 tons. There are many challenges when building this helicopter and in the end only two were built. The Rolls-Royce Phantom Sedan the Phantom Extended Wheelbase may not be the biggest on-road vehicle, but it's larger than your average sedan. Starting price is $450,000, and if you thought that was insane, most buyers have a long list of additions that they'd like to add on. This usually bumps up the price to $600,000. The vehicle weighs 5,900 pounds, or 2,675 kilograms. Despite it being so weighty, it can reach speeds of 155 miles per hour, or 249 kilometers per hour. The interior is everything you'd expect from a Rolls-Royce, soft leather, deep wood, veneers, Wi-Fi hotspot, and rear seat entertainment. American Saturn V This monster carried astronauts to the moon in 1969. 
is the heaviest, tallest, and most powerful rocket to ever achieve this accolade. It stood at 138 feet tall, or 42 meters, and manned 7,648,000 pounds of force to take off. It could reach speeds of 2.58 kilometers per second, or 263 seconds, which would then dip as it went into space. The rocket weighed 2.8 million kilograms, or 6.2 million pounds, equivalent to 400 elephants. The Bagger 288 this behemoth was completed in 1978 and stood 94 meters tall or 311 feet. It was also 214 meters long or 702 feet and weighed an impressive 41,276 tons. It's officially the largest land vehicle in the world and superseded NASA's crawler transporter. It excavates 240 tons of coal every day and works in the Hambach strip mine in Germany. France Char 2C Tank also called the FCM-2C, this French-built tank was 10 meters or 32 feet long and could hold 12 crew members. It was the biggest tank ever made. It wasn't used during World War I, but deployed thereafter. The origins of the tank are a bit mysterious, but it's believed to have been built in the summer of 1916. It was far too slow, making it cumbersome and not an easy piece of equipment to move. The Caterpillar 797B This beast was built in 2002 and used for heavy-duty construction and mining around the world. This version has a larger payload for increased operational efficiency. It features a mechanical powertrain, and the engine can produce 3,500 horsepower, three times that of the fastest supercar. Its payload capacity is 360 tons and weighs 557,900 kilograms, over a million pounds. It reaches speeds of 40 miles per hour or 64 kilometers per hour. The Bell AZ-75710 The length of this massive haul truck is equivalent to two double-decker buses parked back-to-back. -back. It reaches lengths of 20.6 meters or 67 feet and is 8.16 meters or 26 feet tall. It's also 9.87 meters or 32 feet wide. It weighs 360 tons, which is weightier than an average Airbus. The payload capacity is 408,233 tons, making it the largest dump truck in the world. The German Zeppelin Airship Airships were deemed as one of the most luxurious forms of transport in the early 1900s, and the idea for airships was first formulated in 1874. Sadly, after the First World War broke out, airships were mainly used for bombing raids. It quickly became the go-to vehicle after the war, and made some glorious trips when transatlantic routes were open from Frankfurt to Brazil. Length varied, but some were an impressive 235 meters or 770 feet long. The Airship Ventures Company offered a Zeppelin passenger travel between 2008 and 2012 using the Zeppelin NT Air Airship. Sheikh Hamad bin Hamdan Al Nayan's Jeep. He's earned the nickname of the Middle East Chuck Norris. Sheikh Hamad bin Hamdan has a real passion for big, powerful vehicles. Jalopnik reports that Sheikh Hamad was a colonel in the UAE army and he was really taken with this Jeep. He has several oversized vehicles that he has modified, including this enormous Jeep. The Sheikh has a collection of over 400 exotic vehicles and this Jeep is one of his favorites. It's 400% larger in scale than the normal one. He once bought seven new Mercs and they were painted in all the colors of the rainbow. The Knight XV. This armored vehicle is created by Conquest Vehicles and only 100 of them were produced. They have V-10 engines, military strength armor, 4 WD capabilities, ballistic flat run tires, and also comes with a satellite TV. Don't forget about the heated seats, a bar, and if you need one, a black box. Pricing for this vehicle can be in the region of $600,000 and is designed to protect its precious cargo, be it gold or people. The vehicle weighs 5,897 kilograms or 13,000 pounds and has a 6.8 liter petrol engine. Russian Typhoon Class Submarine the Russian 941, or Akula, is a nuclear-powered ballistic missile submarine which was designed in the 1960s but only built in the 1980s. Also known as Typhoons, they are the largest submarines ever built and could have submerged a displacement of 48,000 tons. There are plans to modernize the Typhoons in 2012, but the idea was scrapped because it was felt that the brand's new design would be far more affordable. Two Typhoons are still standing by 2018 and they are meant to be scrapped, but no update has been given. The Sherp ATV This amphibious monstrosity has been described as the best truck in the universe. It comes with every feature imaginable and can come with boulders, fallen trees, and make its way over obstacles 70 centimeters high. It can get through ice, water, and snow, and will perform just as beautifully through the desert. It has a low capacity of up to 1,000 kilograms or 2,200 pounds and boasts a climbing gradient of up to 35 degrees. The Leibheer T282B This monster truck is in a league of its own. Used primarily in mining operations, the Leibheer is an ultra-class dump truck. 
is 15.24 meters long, or 50 feet, by 9.75 meters wide, or 31 feet. It has a payload capacity of 363 tons. It's the second largest dump truck in the world after the Bell AZ75710. It boasts 3,750 horsepower, has a 20-cylinder diesel engine, and can reach speeds of 40 miles per hour or 64 kilometers per hour. The Combat T-98 This machine was released by the Russian manufacturer Darts and can set you back in the region of 1.5 million. Its official name is the Palm Broad Monaco Red Diamond Edition SUV and is allegedly one of the most expensive armored vehicles in the world. Some sites have suggested that you can get the car with black snake skin instead of the whale leather, but if that's the truth, I have a feeling it would be kept on the down low. Ostentatious is a word that best describes this vehicle and it comes with gold plated windows with gauges encrusted with diamonds and rubies. Before we get to number 1, if you could choose to take a ride in one of these big vehicles, which one would you choose and why? Share your thoughts with us in the comments below. Number 1. Mercedes-Benz G63 AMG 6x6 This beauty was launched in 2007 and was initially meant to be used by the Austrian army. It was one of the most expensive vehicles launched by Mercedes at the time. Mass production followed in 2013 and ceased by 2015. Only 20 vehicles were sold each year. The vehicle had a 5.5 liter V8 engine and could produce 536 horsepower. It could reach speeds of 100 miles per hour or 160 kilometers per hour. It can go from 0 to 60 in 7.8 seconds. Curb weight of the vehicle was 2,550 kilograms or 5,622 pounds. The company discontinued the range in 2015 to maintain exclusivity. One was on sale in 2014 for 1.69 million. 